Guys, I'm over at my dad's house and I'm going through my pile of uh, fluorescent tubes that are over here and testing them with my preheat fixture here. And I thought I'd film some of it because why not? You guys seem to enjoy that. I don't have my camera stand so my apologies if the video is, uh, you know, not ideal. Let's see if I can move this a little closer and get a little better. There we go. That's not too bad. Hopefully the camera doesn't fall over. So far I've tested four, nine, four good ones. Uh, five bad ones. So, these all came from, I just bought a bulk package of fluorescent tubes from somebody. I paid like a hundred bucks for like, I don't know, like a hundred four foot tubes and a hundred eight foot tubes. And I gave all the eight foot tubes to my shop landlord because the only eight foot fixtures I have are at my shop. I kept all the four-foots, because I have more four-foots. <coughs> okay, so that one's bad. It's a SLC service lamp, long life, true spectrum. It goes over here in the bad pile. That was a question mark. I'll just put that back in just to show you. I now know that it's bad, but I wasn't sure at the time, just because I hadn't uh, tested enough to see it'll come on, but not all the way. And I wasn't sure if that was a problem with the fixture. But no, all the other bulbs that come on, come on, fine, so. Sylvania Premium Soft White. Come on. Okay, that goes in a good pile. I'm sure my dad would rather I convert it all to T8 or LED. He's very environmentally conscious. Who's an environmentalist? Uh, oh, well that one's not going to be any good because it's broken. Is it anything special? Oh, it's an old GE Wattmiser. Too bad. Poor Wattmiser. And I tried to pick it up and it does. Uh, was already in two pieces, so no hope there. Sylvania Super Saver Cool White 34 Watt. You don't want to leave this in a preheat fixture, but I'll test it in a preheat fixture just because it's what I got to test it with. Okay, well it works. And uh, most of the fixtures down here are rapid start, so it's not going to hurt anything. Here's another Sylvania Super Saver. I think I brought a lot of my Wattmisers and stuff over here. Because all those fixtures over here can take them. Not the ones in the garage, though. Now that I got all those ones in the garage, I gotta be more careful. That's my uh, Pride and Joy Preheat collection right there. Sylvania Household Fluorescent Interior Design. I don't even know what that means. Apparently that's fancy words for warm white, and it works fine. Come on. Ace 40 watt Universal Deluxe. I have a lot of these Ace tubes. I suspect that uh, something from this batch came out of an Ace hardware. Because a lot of them are labeled Ace. Okay. Sylvania Warm White. Plus. So, if you want warm white and extra, you can have this. I like using a preheat fixture to test because I've had some bulbs that would light on a rapid start fixture, but not a preheat fixture. So I feel like this is a truer test. I don't know enough about fluorescence to know if I'm making that up. Philips Econowatt, 34 watts. You know, that may not be true at all. 
I know with the um, new R fixtures, sometimes they'll light a bulb even if it has one bad filament. The new electronic ballast. I really wouldn't mind since nothing down here is preheat except for a few of the like 15 inch and 18 inch fixtures that are in corners. I really wouldn't mind converting this whole basement to electronic ballast, but there's no reason to. This is a Sylvania Super Saver Cool White. We got a lot of those. Here's another one of those ACE tubes. Apparently ACE is the place where none of the lights work. Last one. I was hopeful, but no, this is a Sylvania, just regular warm white Sylvania. So at the end of the day, we got uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. <coughs> 10 either not failed or broke, or, um, or uh, failed, or let me see, there's some, is there more over here? You know it, here's some more. What do we got here? Sylvania Design 50. Ooh la la. By the way, I hate all these fancy tubes. I just want regular 40 watt cool white warm white. That's all I want. Apparently they won't be designing anything around here today. Sylvania Super Saver. I don't think there's a way for me to flip the camera around. No, so you just have to look at my face. There's the uh, good ones, and I'm going to stash them back there, which is where my dad had them stashed. And here's the bad ones. Until my battery dies, let's look around and see if I have any more stashed anywhere, because I tend to stash things places. I wish I could turn the camera around and show you. And no, I don't have any in here. I'm going to go up and look in the garage. A.K.A. Preheat Central. You can see there's the uh, little gold line. Um, I'll show you. I got a spare ballast. I don't know how I can show you there. I got to come over here with my tools sometime. I don't have my tools with me right now. I was just stopping by to pick up a fan and to get the mail. This fixture here. Bad ballast, I'm pretty sure. I tried new tubes and they did nothing. You know what? Let's try new tubes again since we got uh, tubes that have been tested. Why not? What's the harm? I got a new ballast for it. I just haven't been here with tools to take this apart and put a new ballast in there, but why not? 
Well, I saw it light up. Could be good. Just looking for some actual 40 watt tubes just in case that makes a difference. One of the bulbs lit up when I put it in there, but that was as far as we got, so, yeah, I'm going to have to change the ballast in there. Oh, wait, what do we got? Could it be? No, maybe it's just not making good contact. I get to that. I don't see. Yeah, I uh, 